I'm Michelle Koenig, a registered nurse here at Trillium Creek. Today I'm going to talk to you about chemical peels. So chemical peels are acidic solutions that we apply to the surface of our skin that help brighten your skin, diminish fine lines and wrinkles, help with unwanted pigmentation, even out our skin tone, also increases collagen and elastin, it helps with acne, and also smooths out rough skin. So chemical peels are acidic solutions that will apply to the outermost layer of your skin. That skin will then be peeled away, which will reveal a more youthful and brighter appearance of your skin. There's different types of chemical peels that we offer. There's stronger ones, there's lighter ones, there's medium ones, which will be tailored to your specific skin complaint. We can figure that out during a consultation. Now I'll show you exactly how a chemical peel is done. So first we prep the skin by applying Vaseline to the corners of our eyes, nose, and lips to help create a protective barrier. We then will put protective eyewear over your eyes so that the solutions won't get into your eyes. Next, we start by using the primary activator pad. This is used to pre-cleanse and prepare the skin for the acid peel step. Next, this is the primary acid peel. So this is layered onto our face. There's different acids during this step, which we can put on your skin that's tailored to your specific skin concern. This will stay on for about five minutes unless you can't tolerate it, then we'll take it off early. After five minutes, the free acid neutralizer pad is then used and applied to the top of the skin to help neutralize the reaction of the acids. This feels really good and calm to the skin. At this point, there shouldn't be any more stinging or itchy feeling on your skin. Next, we'll apply the All Trans Retinol. This is applied to the top of your skin. This does not itch or sting or burn. This feels also calming to your skin. This is a vitamin A derivative, so this will help activate those acidic solutions that we put on before. This will then sit on your face for five minutes. Finally, we'll wipe away the all trans retinol from your face. We'll put on some SPF and you'll be on your way. So after a chemical peel, it's very important to stay out of the sun. So we want you to wear your sunscreen, wear a hat if you're going to go in and out of your car, into stores. Um, you're going to start peeling for probably two to three days after your chemical peel. Um, that peeling and dryness can last for about five to seven days, depending on your skin. You could use moisturizers, you could put makeup on, but the very most important thing is to stay out of the sun. Thanks for watching this video today. If you have any more questions or interest in chemical peels, you can call us, you can visit our website, you can schedule a consultation appointment. We look forward to seeing you at Trillium Creek Dermatology. Music